So you're recording now? Yeah, I'm recording. Everything's right. taking the load. I'm glad it's working again, though. Yeah. Loading, loading, loading. Hello. So you might want... Hello. I have something to show you. I'm not gonna. I'm not just gonna let you uh, discover this one. I'm gonna show it to you because I can't wait. Okay. <laughs> I was letting the world load in, but we're good now. What's up? We're looking at the machine. Oh, yeah. We've been having the some. By the way, oh. that's awesome. Oh, uh, that's the one I did today. That was today's episode. Cool. I'm glad you like it. Oh, we have a big Oh man, Mall Flanders proprietor. Um, it's even got hearts. In it. Yes, but but what what are these? Oh, that's just wrong. Oh, <laughs> you made the red light district. That's hence you the Mall it. Flanders. I get it. I get it. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> I meant to. I, I need to put another sign up here. Yeah, that sailors must go upstairs. Yeah, I was gonna say. I like how you have it right next to the dock. <laughs> well, yeah, of course. <laughs> oh man, that is awesome. What? Oh, these are mine wood. Okay. Oh man. <laughs> You've even got like the little rooms. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Just little stalls with beds, essentially. <laughs> The, the ones downstairs are nicer. The sailors have to be upstairs. <laughs> uh, I don't think I saw the one downstairs. Mm, no, not that one. There we go. How do you get... Oh, there's a door. The one thing at this door is all blend in. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, you even put chairs. Very nice. Uh, no, how fancy. All fancy. That looks good. This is where the See, high pay girls go. I... I have more than zero taste. Not much more, <laughs> but I have more than zero taste. <laughs> oh, I love it. This is awesome. <laughs> it's oh, not man. nearly as impressive as the oubliette, but I wanted to. I've I've been wanting to do this for a while and, and uh, add it to yeah. a little town here. I remember you mentioning doing the red light district. In all honesty, if this were more realistic, this would have been up like right after the f first couple of buildings. <laughs> <laughs> But we're a high-class town. It, it took us a while to get ourselves a proper bra. Oh, and did you water. see the masonry building? Yes, that's very nice. I haven't shown the people's the masonry building. I have to remember to take my goggles of revealing off, though, so you get that annoying aura out of the way. Yeah, yeah I replaced so it could... with marble panels. I could not do the marble pillars because the mm. texture for the micro blocks are not in the system. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're the... the uh, hot pink and black blocks. Anyway, so yeah, the, that's why I did the put texture here. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So that's that's why I did this kind of. I thought this was kind of a cool design, and it kind of echoed, you know, being a little bit square. So and then of course just added the detail to the top to make it more pillary looking. Oh yeah, it looks very nice. Yeah, and then of course did the ceiling, and then did the quarried stone facades, which I should have probably smelted the quarried stone before I made the facade but I didn't think of it until I got it all in and I was like well forget about it so oh come on one of equal trade huh one of equal trade can you do that with the facades though I don't know I know you can't paint the facades because I tried painting them to match the limestone a little bit more but yeah I haven't shown the people this so this is what this is people's I don't, yeah, I didn't even do an episode. I just did it. So. He's very nice. Yeah. So this this is the, the inside lamps. of the masonry building. Oh, yeah. The glowstone lamps. And then to hide the levers, I did the, yeah. Come on. Up. Up. Uh -huh. Yeah, I did the micro blocks. Nice. You can still kind of see the levers. Originally, I thought the levers would kind of make it look like they were hanging on, you know, would be what was attaching it to the ceiling. But, mm -hmm. you know, I didn't accommodate for how short they were. So, hello, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Monster. I am Marila, and I hope you enjoyed that little snippet where Just Star surprised us with his little brothel over there. Um, that is too funny. It's I love the fact that it's 
you know, all this gray and brown and then big pink building right there, right next to the dock. Anyway, I uh, just wanted to go ahead and finish up this episode, or I guess technically start it for sure. We're going to work on mariculture today, uh, specifically trying to get some fish oil so we can make polished sticks so we can go up on the tier for fishing rods. Uh, the reed rod, which is what I was starting with, just does not cut it. Um, so the next level is the wooden fishing rod. The titanium is the one after that. So we're going to wait on that one. But the wooden fishing rod is the one we want that requires polished sticks. And you have to make these in the industrial freezer uh, using fish oil. And so to get the fish oil, you need to make an industrial smelter, which recipe you can find. I'll go ahead and look it up. Um, it, it's it's a few extra it's a few extra steps if I can spell industrial okay it's several steps but it's not too too bad the heating component is really kind of the most the biggest pain because it's got this clay block right here but you make these heating uh, silicon carbide which makes these heating components brick construction is just nether rack or excuse me nether brick and iron bars so it's not too bad but you need to make two of them. Uh, just as the recipe says, you do get the bucket back for the lava, which is really nice. And then from I found a couple of tutorials online, and they were saying that you have to surround it with lava, which is what we have here. That's why these slabs are here, because I've almost fallen in two or three times. So uh, to avoid me burning all my stuff to little cinders and never getting it back, I went ahead and put the slabs down. And sat, been looking at it for a while, and it is so slow. Uh, the heating point of the fish or the melting point, excuse me, for both these fish are 180 degrees Celsius. Uh, we're past that over here, but apparently the higher it goes, I'm assuming the faster it goes, at least I'm hoping, because it feels like it's been, oh, it feels like 10 minutes, which means it's probably been about five. But it has been several minutes sitting here waiting for just one bucket. It's like, come on, give me one bucket. Just one bucket. This is what I have been doing for a while. This is why I've not been recording. It looks like you can do two at a time, I'm guessing. Uh, that's why I have the two different ones there so we can test it, which will be good. But we need to make a uh, excellent fish oil. Okay, you can do two at a time, so let's go ahead and split those up. Give a little bit of fish oil. Finally. Okay, and I got this tank. We'll, we'll do a, a more permanent setup, but for now we're just going to... It's just going to be a little bit ghetto, but that's okay. Um... Excellent. So we have very slowly, see, look, not even registering yet. There it is. And that's at 432 degrees Celsius. So this is, this is not going to be a, excuse me, this is not going to be a super fast process. It's going to be a little bit slow, but the, like I said, the reed rod is just not cutting it. Uh, what I really want is this auto fisher. Auto, automobile. Uh, no, this auto, automatic fisher here which you need two of these wooden fishing rods for. So it's not just that I want to have the rod, but I want two of these rods so I can make this automatic fisher, which you can then run with build craft energy and get it all automated so you don't have to sit here and just, you know, fish. This is Fishing is not the most exciting thing in Minecraft. So we're going to go ahead and let that run. Uh, and like I said, we're going to need to make these with the industrial freezer. So let's just do the Maricraft, the Mariculture mod. Uh, Mariculture. So we need the industrial freezer, which is this guy here. And that requires water, iron construction blocks, cooling components. So it's a similar construction. It does obviously take a few extra pieces. It looks like this one's cheaper. Uh, this is another, I don't know if I mentioned on this one, but the industrial smelter, you have to make two and stack them on top of each other. So there's that block of lava, and underneath that block of lava, or in the center of that, this little lava pool is another industrial smelter. Uh, I thought you could stack them three high, but apparently the, the maximum is two. And you do need, or I should say the maximum and the minimum are both two. And speaking of mariculture, in case you have not noticed, I kind of went a little bit crazy with the pearls. I have just a few. I went to the ocean mistcraft world and kind of went a little bonkers with them. I figured I'd go ahead and farm pearls for a while. This does make it much quicker. It looks like it's ready to be farmed again. That one's not quite ready over there. Um, but it does make it much quicker to, to farm them. I figure I'll get 
you know, quarter stack, half a stack on each color, and then I'll put, I'll keep probably a few out there, maybe three or four going, and then the rest I'll put in this system here. Uh, so we are going to go ahead and need iron, which I don't know why I'm looking in the gems. I've been having lag issues, so you'll have to bear with me. Okay. Go ahead and just get some of this iron here. I think we're going to make, let's see, so we need to make two of these. We'll probably have to stack, I know we, we'll have to stack this one like the smeltery, so we'll need four of these actually. Uh, so just planks, okay, easy enough. And make some more, we'll go ahead and make more planks. So like this and like this, actually, before I do that, I need to break these down. I'm good at this game, I swear. Okay. So we need to make four of these. One, two, three, four. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. That one was easy. What's the next step? Okay. It's the iron construction block. We need two of those, which means we need some glass panes. It was panes, correct? I believe it was panes, which we only have three, so. Okay, we'll make couple or a couple of yeah you know what I mean two of these like this see two couple each slot there we go half a stack uh, I think it was just like this like that right like this and like this no okay we did something wrong what did I do wrong this real freezer iron construction oh okay don't need the center so we need two of these. Thank you. Good. Then we need a bucket of water, more glass, more iron. Okay. So two buckets of water. I've got another bucket on me. If I can access them. So the lag issues coming into play again. There it is. One more bucket. Then we need two pieces of glass. Put that up. One, two. Go ahead and sort that because I'm crazy. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. Let's get my buckets ready. Let's go grab that water. Anytime I go out here now to grab water, I have deja vu of the wither and my frantic potion making. Okay. I still kind of seeing that video. I still have to kind of just shake my head. At how many mistakes I made, but that's all right. We, we're all starting out. We all got to start out sometime, right? Okay, so we need two of these and four of these and two of these and one of these. Excellent. You get see you get the bucket back, which is quite quite nice. All right, so that should do it. Let's go ahead and put this in the system. I'll put that in the system. Put that in the system. I killed the spiders. So we don't need those. Then we need the ice, because we're going to have to do the same thing. Oh, do we not have... I know I grabbed a bunch of ice. Huh. Did I leave that? Because I, I, that masonry building, I originally did ice pillars before I changed my mind on them. So I had to go get... I got over a stack of ice. Did I leave them here? Yes. Okay, that's good. Okay. Good, good, good. Worried me for a second. Okay, so do we have everything we need? For now, I think we do. Okay, let's run. This will be our fishery building eventually. It'll be right here. I will might level this out. Probably we'll end up leveling this out and moving everything around. Um, let's go ahead and put this here. With my OP shovel. Okay. And then we have to put all of the... <laughs> put the but the shovel destroyed, we have to put back together. Okay. So, the industrial freezer will go right in the center. Like, oop. Like so. Oh! Do we have two, or is this, is this one or two? It looks like it's one. Oh. I thought we needed two. Apparently we only need one. Alright. Like I said, I did watch a couple of tutorials on this, so I think I'm doing it right. Then we put the ice down keep it cool. Go ahead and move that. I don't know if that's too close or not, but just in case. And 
We'll put another one down there. And one right there. Okay, that should do it. So we have our industrial freezer. I think you put the fish oil here. Maybe the sticks here? Possibly? Perhaps? Let's see if we can get any of the fish oil out. How much do we have? I don't even think that's a bucket's worth. Does bucket go there? No. Bucket go there? Bucket must go there. Bucket melting point. That This better not melt. It shouldn't melt. Oh wow, we haven't even done... Wow, it hasn't even done another set. <laughs> this is the same one we've been waiting on while we were making the, the industrial... Uh, and the industrial freezer. Wow. Yeah. Is it at least getting hotter? No, it's staying, it's staying the same heat. I wonder if I put like a bucket of lava in there, will it get hotter? You know, I think I've got cold coke somewhere. I wonder if we put cold coke. Do the, these things burn hotter than, does it say? No. I was wondering if certain things burn hotter than others. So if we use, let's get one of these. I hate breaking up even stacks like that, but. Okay. So if I put, instead of this, if I do a piece of coal coke, will that burn hotter? Maximum temperature, 2,000 degrees Celsius. I'm going to take that as a yes. Did it tell me while that was in here what the temperature was? Oh, maximum temperature, 2,000 degrees Celsius. So it doesn't really matter. Let's, well, I got the cold coke. Let's go ahead and throw that in there. We did get more fish oil, though. Not even a bucket's worth, though. Finally broke that in. Wow, yeah, this is not a fast process at all. This, this is going to take a while before we can even get to the next step. So uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode... <laughs> Uh, we'll probably continue this next episode when we hopefully have more than a bucket or two of materials. Let me take my... Actually, you never get to see my full outfit. I like seeing my full outfit. Thank you very much. Including my little gun holsters. I like that. Huh? Huh? Nice? Yeah? We need guns in this mod. Not really. I probably would never use it. I like my sword. Speaking of which... Sword. There we go. Vera is too awesome. Anyway, so yeah, we'll, we'll end it here. We'll work on mariculture <laughs> when we have more than, you know, a minuscule amount of fish oil to work with. Uh, so yeah, but I, I will talk to y'all later. Thanks everyone for watching. Bye.